Welcome to Trading Lounge and the European Indices for the 1st of July, starting with the DAX here. Um, we've had two counts for the DAX, um, a primary count and our trading one is on the one hour chart, which this one is. So um, in this case here, we were looking at this as five waves up here for one, ABC for two, then up for one, back for two is 61.8%. And we were looking at being long above this high here at a half a position and a full position um, at this uh, stage here. And obviously the market's gone into um, a strong third of a third wave here. I may have to take this up one degree higher. So instead of having this wave three here in gray, we'll have probably have to have it in green one degree higher, but um, for the time being, that's fine. Um, um, yeah, we can just expect this market to, um, to, to, to move higher. This level here shouldn't be there. That should be there, which the market's just gone straight through. It's, it, it may come back and test that, but it would only be in a short uh, span to do that. So we'll just leave the stop um, at this point here and we've also lined these European markets up with the US markets as well, but the US, <clears throat> so obviously one of them was going to be, going to be wrong. Um, so this has been the right count here. If we go to the four hour chart here, we were looking at it um, like this here with wave one up here and A wave and a B wave and a C wave here. But that changed on Friday with our charts um, as well. So we don't need this one here at the moment. So with this one here, we can pretty much move this one with one and two in here. This is another way to look at it. This is one degree higher here. But we never got triggered in on a short trade here, so we've just been triggered in on the long trade, so we're okay with this. So we just try to take the next logical step with everything in terms of dividing analysis up from trading. They're two different, um, two different things, so. So we're in a third of a third of a third here. So this is why we're seeing that strength come into the market uh, here. It's okay, um, 12, 12, five is the most important one here. So we use the Fibonacci numbers as a price ratio. So in that case here, we'd use one, two and three and five and eight. There are main levels to the upside. So we may see this come back and test um, this space here, but um, essentially we'll still see that moving up uh, higher there. <clears throat> and the FTSE, same, we had sort of two counts working here as well. So we've, this is slightly different, but um, we've had wave one here and we're looking at an A and a B wave to here and a C wave to here for wave two. And we were looking to go long above this one here. So that's been triggered in there. So that's fine. Um, I can just copy this here and put that in red and we'll go for a Trade it up with some stops now. So it's hit 7,500. Five is the second strongest number. <clears throat> so it's going to sit there for a while. Um, we'll just leave that there for a while until we'll leave the stop out of the way until we've got a, a secondary pattern at the five here. But the normal process for this is the arrival, the reaction, first high above the level, and then a corrective pattern here, uh, and then up again from there. So we can also look to move in on this particular setup here. We should be able to buy back here as well. So at group two here, so 80, um, 80 and also um, uh, copy that in 
72 in that space in that space there you can also buy again as well so we don't need this B wave here anymore in fact we can just delete these ones now so even we had two counts here we still we still did the logical thing in terms of uh, trading to the upside there which is good and that's got further to go so we should see nice strong trend continue um, in this space and this will be the same for the MIB as well so for Italy here um, it's a little bit of a different um, count uh, here I, we don't have a trade on here at the moment for this and I just left this on the US side of the fence here so we can remove that what I mean by that is um, the US count in line with the S&P but um, in this case here it counted a little bit differently because I could count one two three four uh, one and two and three and four and five to this point here a little a and b and c in here for wave two then one and two and three and four and five which gives us the third wave here um, so in this case here <clears throat> we'd need to look at this as the fourth wave here and the fifth wave coming up into this space here probably the uh, closer to the 22 here certainly above this top here um, as such um, yeah so we don't really have that um, don't have that five wave structure to the upside for this just yet in this market Um, so this is a completely different count, but not completely different, but it's, it's, um, I mean, I could probably even fit the DAX into this count too, you know, um, but I'll just leave it the way it is for the moment. Let's just, let's just see how this, how this trend here stretches out here, um, as such. So... Just getting an idea of length here. So yeah, we should be about there. That's about right. Yeah, we should see something about there. We'll see. Um, if it goes, if this trend goes further than the 22 here, then we'll need to look at it. This is as, as a third of a third wave up here. Um, it's certainly showing that by gapping here. Um, but yeah, I'll just stick with this count for the for the time being. Um, but you can expect this to uh, to move higher after. I mean, it's going to at twenty one five hundred here, um, and the old high here. Of course, it's going to um, to pull back, but should climb higher and eventually sit on top there. So we can look at a classic trading levels pattern. So the arrival, the reaction, the first high above the level in five waves, then some type of corrective move here, and then a move up from that point there. So buying the pullbacks would be fine at this uh, in this stage because this trend is certainly not finished to the upside on that alrighty um thanks for tuning in much appreciated cheers